th there would be alligators here if there was water, but there, there aren't any big ponds really. I doubt that a gator gets in that pond where the fish, where the fish are uh, up by the bell tower. Are you guys ready to go find um, rubbing post number three? Yes. Let's do it. It's a squirrel. It's a squirrel. Is it a squirrel this time? Yeah. Cool. We found yet another rubbing post up here on the top of the hill. And while we're there rubbing, this dude is out looking for nuts. Squirrel looking for nuts. And it also is a squirrel. Squirrel eating something. Watch mine be better. Look at Nicole scratch up a storm. Or rub up a storm, I should say. Mm -hmm. Well, you can really see that squirrel coming out on the paper. Boo boo, what's that? Boo boo, what's that green thing on the end of your finger? You've been going for nose candy again, girl? No. Huh? No, she was picking the squirrel's nose, nose candy. Uh -uh. Picking squirrel nose candy? Ooh, uh -uh. gross. Um, hold on. Hear the bell tower, girls? Yeah. It's singing just to you. I think these girls are having some fun hunting for the rubbing post and then drawing the pictures. Is it fun? Yeah. Good. Are you getting too hot? No. Okay, you let me know if you do and we're out of here. Boo Boo's going to rub that stick to a nub. Hey, we might be able to get some berries for the girls off of this plant. Hey, chicks, there's some fruit over here for you. Right over here, Nicole. You can pick that fruit and have it in the movie. No, that's okay. You don't think you'd like that? No. I think you might. What kind of fruit is it? Do you know? Uh, no. She says, okay. I'm handcuffed. Right, Boo Boo? Let's yep. roll. Okay, let me see where the next rubbing post is. Remember when we were coming over, you asked me why Edward Bach built, built the tower here? And I said it was on the highest spot in the, the Florida Peninsula? Yeah. And you're standing on it right now. This is called Iron Mountain, and you're about 300 feet above sea level, which is the highest landmark in all of peninsular Florida. Wow. So that... the. I know it does. The next one is down this trail somewhere, so keep your eyes open. Can you hold that back for her, Nicole, and then she can scratch and then she can hold for you. And and this one's a nake? Yes. All right. Look at Boo Boo doing her thing and Nicole helping her out by holding the flower back. Is it coming out good, Boo Boo? Yeah. Yep, here I am right by the pond while the girls are doing yet another rubbing post. This time it is the image of a nake. But we have to get out of here soon because Boo Boo said there's a lot of piters back here. And she does not like her piters. Right, Boo Boo? Right. One up here. Now Nicole's doing hers while Boo Boo holds the flower back. Any piters over there, Boo Boo? Nope. Okay. We don't want you girls to have to have any bouts with bugs because uh, we know you don't like them. You know what? I'm starting to sweat. Me too. I'll tell you what, girls. I think it's time for us to go back to the car. Get Can we some. The one in the parking lot? Well, we're going to go back to the parking lot now because it's gotten warm. 
walking around and uh, we'll come and do the rest of them another day when it's a little cooler. Is that the nake? One. Bugs out too? Yeah, it looks good. I think one is going to be a rabbit. All right, well, let's go down this trail and head back to the parking lot because it's getting close to movie time and we do not want to be late. We want to get there early so we get one of the best seats. Because we deserve the best, correct? Yeah. You got it. Boo Boo says she's going to climb into that sago palm, knock that big ball or whatever it is out of there, throw some uh, branches down, and nest. And that's where she's going to spend the night. Right, Boo Boo? Yeah. What do you mean, no? Nicole, isn't that what she told you? Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Uh -uh. No, it wasn't you? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we read it on your blog. Ooh, the wind feels so good. Oh, that wind feels wonderful. Mm. And of course, Booba will have plenty of bamboo to eat. She loves the outdoors. Man, that wind feels great. See the branches moving? Boy, I see they have a new garden area planted, and it is loaded with gorgeous, gorgeous flowers and vegetation. Okay, time for me to catch up to the girls. Well, you see the sign, Welcome to Typhoon Lagoon. And that's right. Well, who are we welcoming to Typhoon Lagoon? I think we're welcoming Boo Boo. And we're welcoming, welcoming Nicole. And it's, is this your first time ever to a Disney water park? It is? Are you ready to go have some fun? Well, I say then, let's go do it. You lead the way and I'll follow, okay? And this is it, the girls' first time in the Typhoon Lagoon and they are pumped. And they should be. What's it look like? Does it look, does it look big? Huh? Boo Boo, what do you think? Are you going to enjoy it? Yeah. You are? All right, well, I say uh, go take one look through the thing over there. I already did. Did you, did you look, Nicole? Yeah. Where the girls are right over there? You, ch you already checked it out? Well, then I say let's uh, blow this popcorn stick. There's the crush and gusher right there. So we go in and turn right, see where we are. We're right there. We go in and turn right to Crush and Gusher. You girls going to hit Crush and Gusher today? I don't know. Well, you might. You see that boat right there? That got thrown up in the typhoon. And the girls say, who cares? Get me to the water. Gee, get me to the water. Big Lilo. Nicole just said we are so going on that. It's it's about a mile around, I think. Castaway, huh? You can go on that for sure, Castaway Creek. Looks like the girls are getting set up. Wait a minute. But don't set them back a little bit because you you got them right where the people walk. Yeah, the girls are getting set up. Nicole, honey, what did you just say? The sand feels nice. Does the sand feel good? How did you like the uh, wave pool? It was cute. And how does it compare to uh, Cypress Gardens? Cypress Gardens is windy. It blows the shorts off of Cypress Gardens, doesn't it? Yeah. You think you're going to have fun here the rest of the summer at these water parks? Yes. It's awesome. It's awesome, boo-boo. You know it is. It's awesome and the girls can hardly wait to get out. Look at this place. Yeah. 
It's a beautiful water park. And what we're doing is we're setting up right by Shark's Reef. That's Shark Reef right back there. We'll or go. Do you, or do you want to just meet here? Yeah, let's meet here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, right here. But if, if, if I can't find you, I'll, if you're not here at our chairs, then I'll go over and look for you at Shark Reef. Boo Boo's getting her uh, sunscreen on. Lather up, girl. Make sure you got plenty of sunscreen on you. And what are you going to hit first? Probably the Lady Ranger. That's called, it's called Castaway Creek. That's the Lazy River. In just a second, you'll see the girls in Castaway Creek. Uh, the girls are putting the final touches, uh, the final touches are being taken care of to get that uh, sunscreen on. Nicole, don't forget to cover up my camera bag, okay, please, honey? Are you girls well protected now? Okay. There they go, into Castaway Creek. Hi girls. How's the water? You can't tell it yet, but right back there are the girls, and it looks like they've uh, gotten themselves an inner tube. Yeah, they're waving. They've spotted me up here. As usual, Big G sweats it out making the memories while everybody else has fun. To admit I had Boo Boo lie on her birth date. She has a child's annual pass. It saved me probably uh, 30 or so dollars. Having fun. And the girl should be coming out from underneath that bridge any second. But I still don't see them. There they go. Man, I can hardly stay up with the girls, even though I'm walking and they're in the water. This park is already jammed with people. I don't know. I've ne they, they never had gu Gusher Crusher when I was here before. How come you girls got... Honey, Gusher Crusher, they didn't have that slide when I was here, but it's some kind of a water roller coaster. So can we go on it? Yeah, let's go over and see what Gusher Crusher is all about. Boo Boo and Nicole checking out Shark Reef. They just told me that there's a $20 charge per person. When I was coming here, it was included in the park admission price. Once again, another example of Disney cannot get enough money out of the poor souls that come here.
Well, I'm glad you girls don't want to do this if there's an additional charge. That's ridiculous. Like I said, when, I, when uh, the kids and I were coming here, there was no additional charge. Man, this place is going to give me a heart attack. Why? All the girls. Shark Reef and Circus Scuba, $20 per person. And what do you say to that? Does it suck? What? You know it. Look what Boo Boo just found. Get over there, Boo Boo. Get over there. She's showing us the way to crush and gusher. Well, we've made it to crush and gusher, and the girls are ready to go. There they go, heading to crush and gusher. And this is what crush and gusher is. A water roller coaster. Well, I think I'll go over with the girls and see uh, see what it's all about. On the pineapple plunger. Say it again, honey. No, not right now. Later on today. You want to you you want to go on? What's the name of this thing? Um, Cru crush. crush and gusher. And then there's three different sections: the pineapple plunger, the coconut crusher, and the banana. You and you want to go again? Yeah. We well, yeah. Banana blaster. Well, well, honey, go for it. That's what I brought you over here. No, no, that's the exit. Behind, there you go. All right, what does that ride do? Okay, you're sitting here, and yeah. then you go down, you make a turn, and you go down again, make a turn, and then you go down like two more there, times. Well, what happens when the guy pushes the button? You, you just go, go down. You go really so fast. The boat goes, and then you go. Does it make you go real fast? Yeah. Okay, and now where do you girls want to go? To another slide. All right, well, turn around and I'll be right behind you. Somewhere out there, Nicole and Boo Boo. But I'm not sure where they are. Let's see a wave. Lexi! We were looking for you. Oh, I didn't see all around. We've been looking all around. There's a lot of people. We saw Kelly. Over there. Over there. Over there. Over there. Over there. Over there. Come here, baby. We're right here. Hey, you guys, Mom. Okay, wave any time. Here it comes. Boo Boo and Nicole are enjoying it. I just don't know where they are. Boo Boo and Nicole, where are you girls? All right, where you girls been? What happened? There's a two place. We went down, so we went in kind of deep water. And we almost got sucked under. I know I've, 
I've already videoed it, Nicole. Hey, uh, how does this wave compare to a Cypress Garden? Now I guess they've had their fun in the wave pool and now they're going to work on their tan. That's what I think they're going to work on their tan. Hey, you can't work on your tan when the sun's behind a cloud. Here comes the water. Now the girls have found a wave pool that is more their speed. You girls hungry? Let's get something to eat. I just heard Boo Boo say, mmm. And they should be good. Two sodas, two fries, ten dollars. From now on we bring a cooler with our own sodas and snacks. Right girls? Yeah. This is ridiculous. Well, it's, I mean, at least it's good, though, isn't it? Those fries are really... Nicole said they are yummy. And what... It's a nice day to come out Oh, it's a perfect day. It's just some white clouds in the sky. It's got to be up in the 90s. This, I thought it was going to rain because I thought I heard thunder, but really it was the waves. The way... Oh, yeah, that does sound like thunder. But this, this has been a perfect day for your first day at Typhoon Lagoon. And Sunday, we're going to hit Blizzard Beach. And Monday, we're going to hit Haines City Local Pool because that's all we can afford. Nuh-uh. What do you mean, nuh-uh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Right, Boo-Boo? Yes. Nuh-uh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, I, your mom gave me enough money that on the way home we can stop at Mickey D's for a double cheese and then that'll be it. That's all the coin that uh, they have. So that's better, hey, that's better than nothing, right? Mm -hmm. What time is it? I don't know. It's getting close to one o'clock. Okay, because we still have a lot to do. Well, you can't do it all in one day there, boo-foo. Oh, boo boo. The, that's a long fry. Oh, boo boo. The chick comes here for the first time and she wants to try to do everything in one day, and it's not even a full day. We're only going to be here two or three hours today. <laughs> boo boo, how come you get the small fries and she gets the big fries? I had one that's huge, but then I ate it. You ate it? Was it yummy? Ooh, look how big this fry is. Nicole, you got all the good fries. That's even better than the last one. I'll tell you what, you got the good fries. Okay. Well, say bye. Wait, wait, wait. wait I, I picked the one. one. I picked the one. What? I picked the one that looked fuller. You did? You put a hurting to Boo Boo yet one more time? Boo Boo, did she put a hurt to you, girl? Did she? Well, that's what happens when you're the youngest. I used to put a hurt to my sister, too. Mmm, Boo-Boo says, oh, that Coke is so good. Is it good, Boo-Boo? Yep, now here we are. The girls had to try old Crush and Gusher one more time. They're going to go on this and Humunga Cowabunga. And by then, it'll be around two or a quarter after. And we'll be out of here. Girls have to go home and... Well, I know you're probably wondering what this is all about. 
It's about G having a smoke. And yes, I was able to find a deserted area in Typhoon Lagoon where nobody will bother me and I can have a peaceful cigarette. Now that's not too shabby. Yeah, the girls are on a slide right now. And uh, I'm having uh, a quiet moment on a beautiful day. This area of Typhoon Lagoon has been added since I used to come over here. This Crush and Buster or whatever it is I keep tra having, uh, forgetting the name of it, was not here when the kids and I were coming to Typhoon Lagoon. Do you mean to tell me that you girls are done with that slide already? Yeah. I was back at the other exit waiting for you girls. That's how you missed me. I know, I was at the wrong place. Well, did you, okay, now let me ask you this. Did you go on all three slides? Yes. You did. Can yep. we go to the other slide now? Which one, Humunga Cowabunga? Yes. yes. I will take you girls to Humunga Cowabunga. Get ready for the thrill of a lifetime. Your mom would be peeing her pants if she saw that slide. What, what did you say? You're what? Thank you. Oh, no, but you said you're... I'm excited. You're excited? Well, you're welcome. I'm glad you girls are having a great time. You are having a great time, aren't you? Yes. And next time when, when we come, I'm going to have a great time too because I'm going to swim. And but, then can we go a little bit in the lazy river? Uh, our hair? It, it depends on how much time we have, but I think we'll have time. Okay, let's go. We're going to head over to Yamunga Cowabunga. The girls say that there's glass in the sand. That's not too cool. All right, girls, let's head down to Humunga Cowabunga. Just keep going straight. Which way to Humunga Cowabunga, girls? Are you sure you want to go on Humunga Cowabunga? Huh? You're absolutely certain, right? All right, then it's on to Humunga Cowabunga. And this is what the girls are going to go on. Yamunga Cowabunga. Huh? We're having a little trouble finding the line for Humunga Cowabunga. Do you want to go on storm slides first? These slides here? Which ones do you want to go on? All right, hang on a minute. We're almost the to the top of Umunga Calabunga. When that light turns green, you girls can go down. Nicole, did you say you're not sure you want to do this? Boo Boo said, I can't wait to do it. These didn't used to be covered though. They used to be open. When that light turns green, you watch that little turkey roll. Oh, I heard some squealing. Go for it, Nicole. You're going to love it. You don't want to do it? All right, we'll walk back down. Well, Nicole decided that she's going to wait and go on it the next time we come over here because her back was hurting a little bit. Right, Nicole? So you'll do it next time, maybe? Okay, well, that's cool. I don't blame you if your back's hurting and you should not be doing it. Did you see Boo-Boo? Uh, yeah. All right, let's go check her out. And this is where you come out from Humunga Calabunga. I'll wait and see if I can get somebody else coming down. Wait and see if I can get somebody else coming down. 
One more time. Somebody should be coming down right away. And there they come. The end of another fun humonga cowabunga. All right, girl, tell me about it. I saw the drop and I knew that I was oh. here, but I did it anyway. And it was really fun. What kind of fun was it? It was really fun. I would want to go on it again. Well, you can ride it many times all summer long, and, Come on, and I'll ride it with you, okay? okay? All right, now let's go on the storm slides, girls. Around to your left. Okay, Boo Boo and Nicole just went up the steps for the storm slide, so they should be coming down pretty soon. And I'm not going to walk up this one with them because I'm getting tired and it's pretty hot. And Boo Boo and Nicole will be coming down these slides very shortly. I'm going to try to pick up, pick them up when they come down, if I can. You actually have to walk across this little creek. And the water goes right into the uh, into the little pool at the end of the storm slides. Well, I'm still waiting for Boo Boo and Nicole to come down these slides. That must have been a heck of a line that they're in because they've been up there for about 10 minutes. It didn't take that long to go through Humonga Cowabunga. Come on, chickadee. There's Nicole, which means Boo Boo should be right behind her somewhere. And there's little Boo Boo, down from the storm slide. Even this, uh, this uh, even though this girl's a big chicken, she is going to do humonga cowabunga. With your arms and ankles crossed in front of you, wait for the green signal before you go, and keep your hands and feet within the slide. As soon as you reach the bottom of the slide, please exit to the side immediately. For your safety and enjoyment, please lie flat on your back with your. Okay, let me see how you prep for this ride. How are you getting ready? Let me see those breaths. She had a bit of chicken in her, but now she's going to do humonga cowabunga. All right, here's Boo Boo one more time at the top of Humonga Cowabunga, and she's ready to roll. Waiting for, there goes the green light. Okay, Nicole. No, none of that now. You've got to go for it, girl. She'll be glad she did. It's the best slide in the park by far. There she goes. Well, you heard what she thought of it. Well, I'm sure the girls are down there waiting for me. And now that Nicole has done Humonga Calabunga once, I doubt very seriously that she uh, will not continue to ride it. I think the girl has been a, a convert now of Humonga Calabunga. And that, the, the girl did it. She did Humonga Cowabunga. I didn't want to, but I pushed myself. Now will you ride it again? Was it great? Yeah. I told you it was a lot of fun. Let me see how you were waving your arms. That's what she was doing when I was walking down the steps. She said, I conquered Humonga Cowabunga. And you did, too. You should be proud of yourself. Did you hear her scream all the way down? I heard it, and I think the camcorder probably heard it. So, uh, Can you hear me? I, I heard both of you. I said so. 
Yep, yeah, I, I heard. I heard both of you kids, believe me. All right, go get in the pool, and because we got to get out of here. No, honey, there's no time. Get your hair, get your hair fixed up so that it doesn't have a bunch of knots in it, and and then we have to go. Come on. I wish we had time, but Ariel, Ariel's counting on you. Come on, got to get out. Let's go. Well, this is it. The end of the first day ever at Typhoon Lagoon. And we're getting ready to get out of here. Sunday, it'll be Blizzard Beach. On the way out, there'll be showers that you girls can use. So get your things. Well, we're going to take a shower when we get home. Yeah, yeah but you're going to have to shower that sand off or you can't get in my car. But I'll show you where the showers are, okay? This is it. The end of their first day ever at Typhoon Lagoon. Tell everybody in the audience bye-bye. Bye. And tell, and tell them, too bad that you can't be here. And tell them. Too bad you can't be here. That's right. We're here and you're not. All right, girls. Where are we? For the first time, yet another Disney venue. Uh, I, I, aren't you girls getting a little tired of all this Disney stuff? No. Last night, Fort Wilderness for a campfire. Day before, the lagoon. And now we're here at the beach. Monday, it will be McKenzie Falls, right? What is that back there? Lotta Wada Lodge. Okay, well, I this is it. This is Boo Boo and Nicole's first time ever at Blizzard Beach. And what kind of a day will it be for swimming? Awesome. It's going to be definitely awesome because it's definitely hot here right now. Boo Boo, are you ready to hit Summit Plummet? Yes. You can handle it, girl? How about you? I'm not sure. Yeah. I think I, the chicken has already come out. Okay, girls, you lead on and I'll be right behind you. Now, you may wonder what Nicole's fucking about. Well, I'm going to show you. Right back up there is Summit Plummet. And I don't know if Nicole is going to be able to handle that one. What do you think, Nicole? You going to be able to handle that one? I'm not sure. You're not sure yet, huh? Okay, well, let's go find ourselves a uh, uh, some benches and that so that we can set up, okay? Which way do you want to go, right or left? Right. Okay, you lead and I'll follow. What is it that has the girls so captivated? So captivated that they'll stand out here in the sun instead of going to swim? Well, we'll have to find out. Could it be yet another lazy river? What's this one called? Any idea? No. Huh? Well, we'll find out. We're getting closer and closer to Summit Plummet. You know the routine. The girls peel the duds, got their bathing suits on underneath, so they're ready. But of course, they're going to have to put on the uh, sunscreen. I'm not putting sunscreen on until I'm done videoing because I don't want that greasy stuff all over my hands and getting on my camera. Right, chickadees? Yeah. Uh, I, I knew you'd see it my way. Now, while you girls are putting on the sunscreen, I'm going to go over there where it's close up to Summit Plummet and uh, get a little video of what Boo Boo's going to go down and what Nicole may go down. Does that sound like a good idea? Yeah. Okay. I'll be right back, okay?
All right. Well, that's it. Close up, summit plummet. Yeah, I think the girls will have a lot of fun here today, and actually, so will I. I'm going to go in the water a little later on. I don't know if Nicole and Boo Boo will uh, be into this stuff or not. It looks like it may be a kitty area. Although I know David would love it. Even at 28. There they go, their first trip into Cross Country Creek. And now my task will be to keep up with them. Well, I see the chicks got themselves an inner tube. As long as they stay on that tube, it'll be a lot easier for me to keep up with them. They just abandoned the tube and I'm in trouble. Okay, I'm heading over to that bridge so that I can video the girls as they come through Cross Country Creek. As you can see, this is a beautiful water park also, loaded with vegetation. Now the girls should be coming any second, but I don't see them. I'd say this wave pool is nothing compared to Typhoon Lagoon. Now to go find the girls. That baby is really up there. All right, what are you chicks going to do now that you want me to video? Iceberg climbing. Iceberg climbing? You too, Boo Boo? Yeah. Do you think I'll be able to video it? Yes. Will I be able to do a good job, do you yes. think? Yes. All right, girls, I'll be right behind you. The girls are waiting patiently to do the ice cube climb. And I'm going to go around on the other side where I have the sun at my back. Nicole just waved at me. They're going to try and get across these ice cubes. Will the girls be athletic enough to do it? Well, we're going to find out in just a moment. I think they'll do fine. I don't like those gray clouds that I'm seeing back above the trees, but hey, even if it rains, we've had our fun, and what do we care? We'll just, we're coming back uh, next weekend anyway. Typhoon Lagoon. Mercy. Oh, 
I was born in the wrong era. Lizard Beach, a water park in a snow-capped mountain. Nicole and Boo Boo still waiting patiently, but they, their turn is coming up very soon. We're going to see what kind of athletic ability these chicks really have. They say they're good. We're about to find out. All right, I think Boo Boo is just about ready to go. Of course, she's going to go first because Nicole always has her be the guinea pig. There that little girl goes. Come on, boo-boo. What can you do, girl? Oh, she's doing real good. Look at that little monkey go. In a minute, I'll be checking on Nicole's progress. Boo-boo's having no problem. Now, uh-oh, Boo-Boo's in the water. Now let me check on Nicole. Well, she's out to the second iceberg. She's moving on to another one. Look at that little turk go. She says, I got the tools, I got the talent. She may make it all the way across. She's motoring. She's doing real good. Real good. She's going to make it all the way across. She did it. You sure did do it, didn't you? Natalie fell. I know, I saw that. I got it all. Because I have coordination and she doesn't. I'm telling you, you did a great, great job there, little girl. Give yourself a woohoo. Woohoo! You got it. I want to go again. All right, this video is just about full. It'll be time for me to put a new, uh, new uh, disc into the camcorder. You like Blizzard Beach? Yeah. Do you love it? All right. Hey, boo boo. What ha what happened to you, girl? Tell me, give me the story. I was to get, um, get to the other one, and the other cube slipped away from my foot, so I fell. Do you know who made it all the way across? Michael. I know she did a great job. Are you girls? Are you girls going again? Yeah. All right, go for it. I want to tell everybody in the audience that Boo Boo did do the uh, ice cube walk a second time. And then Boo Boo, did you make it all the way through? Yeah. All right, now I want you to tell everybody in the viewing audience what you two turkeys are going to do now. Summit plummet. We're going to summit plummet. And did I hear you, Nicole, say you're doing it no matter what? Yes. In other words, there'll be no... Yeah, I'm going to push myself. You're gonna put. You're gonna force yourself to do it. Yes. But but let me ask you this: Who are you gonna make go down first? Me. How? You're. I always go down first. Well, I wanted to go down first, but Natalie wants to go up first. She wants. I don't want to hear her screaming. Why would that scare you? No, but I still go down. But I just don't want to. Hear her. All right. I want to feel it first. Okay, now this uh, this DVD is about uh, done. But uh, I don't want to uh, go over there with a DVD that's just about filled up because I want to make sure that you guys, that I get you, I'm going to... Okay, just to let you know, before we come down, I'll scream real loud. I'll go, Jerry! And wave your arms. Does yeah. that mean I have to? Huh? Does that mean I have to? Yeah. Nicole, you do it for me. Yeah, Nicole, you can do it for Boo Boo, just that way that I know that Boo Boo's coming down. Yeah, we have to set up a plan. We have to set up a plan. So I'll be down there. 
In fact, what we're gonna do, what we'll do is we'll go over and find a spot where, I, okay, <laughs> as I was saying before, the other disc filled up. We have to formulate a plan. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over and uh, we're gonna find a spot where I can make sure that I can see you waving from up top side so that I can video on the way, video you on the way down, okay? Okay. All right, let's do it. You gonna, are you gonna take Boo Boo Piggy back all the way over there? No. No way? Okay, let's go do it, girls. Summit plummet. You better tie those tops and everything real tight because a lot of people have been known. I don't have any tops. Okay, because you could wind up losing your bathing suits on Summit Plummet. You saw what that girl did whenever she came down. You get extreme wedges. Extreme wedges, you got it. Tie it tight, Nicole. Or, or, or they may be throwing you out of the park for indecent exposure. What are you laughing at, Boo Boo? They'll send you to jail as an accomplice. Summit Plummet, it's waiting for them. Okay. Well, you see it. The girls are going for Summit Plummet. Go for it, girls. Go, Summit Plummet. That is one mean slide. And I'm going to try to video them. Okay, Nicole and Boo Boo should be coming down any second now. And I'll see if I can get them. Thing of it is, is I can't tell who that was. If I counted right, this should be Nicole or Boo Boo. I'm going to go down to the end. This might be Nicole or Boo Boo. We'll find out real quick. No, I, they still haven't come down and I know they're about ready to. So we'll check out another one. No, that wasn't them either. Maybe that wasn't them waving to me, although I thought it was. Well, I'll try one more. I'll try another. Come on, girls. Well, I can't get them, so we'll try it another day. Well, I missed Boo Boo, but I will get Nicole. She's coming down now. And there's Nicole getting off a summer plummet, and I'll get Boo Boo next time. Well, this is it. I didn't get Boo Boo, but I did get Nicole. I'll get Boo Boo the next time we come. I know. That was an intense slide, was it not? It was. Well, that ends the day. We're out of here. We have to get ice cream. Huh? I'll get that for you at DQ. It's cheaper and better. The people behind us, because the dad kept on saying, oh, this feels like you're going straight down. I'll tell you what, girls, I really wish I could ride that slide, but unfortunately I can't. I'd love to try it. It looks awesome. Have you ever been on it? No, no. All right, we're out of here. This is it for uh, Blizzard Beach for today, and we'll catch it, uh, catch it on the rebound, right? You got it. You got everything packed up? Okay.
That's right, the girl's got to do a clean up. Better turn that shower on. Hey, Boo Boo, back up, get your clean off. You cleaned off? Yeah. You get all the sand off of you? You sure? What about your hair? You got to get the hair? Yeah, I got the hair. Okay. You sure cleanup's finished? That looked kind of tired to me. You girls all sand free? Yeah, there wasn't any sand. Free. There was a little bit over at the bobbing pool, but you maybe not even got into it. You maybe didn't get into it. All right, this is it for today. We're out of here. Bye. We're out of here. Bye. Bye. See you later, alligator. On the way out, I think we spotted where we're going to set up the next time we come here, if we get here early enough. Straight across from, uh, what's the name of that creek? Um, Cross Country. Cross, straight across from Cross Country Creek. Looks like you have some private areas, and if they aren't, if they aren't for reservations, we're definitely going to jump on those puppies. Right, girls? Yeah. You know it. Where did you see ducks, honey? You got any peanuts to feed them? Well, then maybe you can catch them and we'll french fry it. That proves that they've been to Blizzard Beach. Hey! Look at that little uh, whatever it is behind you. It's named Button. Yeah, it's named Button. Are you girls ready to roll? Look at it, Gary. Hang on, give me a second. And there's the ducks the girls were talking about. You'd never get up to them. Well, this is it. Fourth grade lunch with the president. <clears throat> the room before the kids get here. but here she is with all of her little friends. Hey, little girl, what president are you? 
turn around and let me see your tie. Boy. You had to retie it? Oh. You're looking very spiffy today. Nervous about giving your speech? Do you have a good speech prepared? Ah, it'll be fine. I read it. It's good. You read it? It's good? Are you sure it's good? Yes. Well, that's cool then. I need a napkin. You need a napkin? Hey, Boo Boo, just wipe it on the tie. It was cheap. No! <laughs> You do? Oh, I didn't know that. Hey. Hey, tell me, how did you get your nickname? No, look at me and tell me. When I was little, I used to get a lot of scabs. And you would always do what? What would you want to do? You'd want to show me your boo-boos, right? Yes. Check out the right girl. How did you like that President's Day, huh? I wanted to do it again. Look up at me here. Now let me see. I want to get your. I want to get your presidential shoes. Let me see your presidential socks. Pull those pants up so I can see your president. Ah, some good presidential socks. And hey, wait a minute. What's that sticking out of your coat, girl? That looks like that tie may have been a little. Who tied that tie for you? Here, unbutton your coat there. Unbutton your coat. I, here, no, back up a little bit. Back up. Back up. Now unbutton that coat. I definitely am going to have to give that woman a little lesson on how to tie a tie. <laughs> oh, you're looking great, boo-boo. That, that was a nice lunch, and, a, and you kids did a uh, really nice job on your presentations. Was it fun? Did you learn anything? Yes. That's the important thing that you learned something. What did you learn? I think you learned to always keep your coat buttoned when you're wearing a tie. Sorry about that shaking, but I can't help it. That was kind of cute. You're going to eat it?